Imagine you're about to buy your first car. You've saved up, you're excited, and then you hear it. We need to check your credit score. What is this magical number and why does it hold so much power? Your credit score is like your financial report card. It tells lenders, landlords, and even potential employers how responsible you are with money. A good credit score can open doors to lower interest rates on loans, better credit card offers, and even lower insurance premiums. On the flip side, a low score can make life more expensive and limit your options. Think of it like this. A good credit score is like having a VIP pass to the best financial deals. It can be the difference between driving off the lot in your dream car or having to settle for something less appealing. Don't let a low credit score hold you back from achieving your financial goals. Understanding how credit scores work is the first step towards taking control of your financial future. Your credit score is a three-digit number, typically ranging from 300 to 850. The higher the number, the better your credit worthiness. Lenders use this score to assess the risk of lending you money. They want to know if you're likely to repay your debts on time and as agreed. Think of it as a measure of trust between you and the lender. Your credit score is calculated based on information in your credit report. This report is a detailed history of your credit activity, including credit cards, loans, and payment history. It's like a financial diary that tracks your borrowing and repayment habits. There are different credit scoring models, but the most common one is the FICO score. Understanding what factors influence your FICO score is crucial for building and maintaining good credit. Your credit report is like your financial footprint. Every time you apply for credit, make a payment, or miss a due date, it leaves a mark. These marks add up to create a picture of your financial responsibility. Your payment history, or how consistently you pay your bills on time, is the most important factor influencing your credit score. Late payments can significantly lower your score, while a history of on-time payments will boost it. Another key factor is your credit utilization ratio, which measures how much of your available credit you're currently using. Keeping your credit utilization low, ideally below 30%, demonstrates responsible credit management the length of your credit history, the types of credit you use, and the number of recent credit applications also play a role in determining your score. Understanding these factors empowers you to make informed decisions that positively impact your credit worthiness. Let's break down this credit score mystery. Imagine a giant calculator crunching numbers based on your financial activities, that's essentially what happens when your credit score is generated. It's not random, it's based on a specific formula. The most well-known score is the FICO score, used by 90% of top lenders. Think of FICO as the gold standard of credit scores. But remember, other scoring models exist, like Vantage Score, each with its own slightly different formula. Don't worry, the basic principles remain the same. Your credit score is a reflection of how well you handle your financial obligations. The score ranges from 300 to 850, with 850 being the best possible score. The higher your score, the more financially trustworthy you appear to lenders. Now you might be wondering, what's considered a good score? Generally, a score above 700 is considered good, while a score below 630 might make things a bit challenging. But remember, these are just guidelines. Each lender sets its own criteria. Section 2. The Building Blocks of Your Score your credit score is like a puzzle, with different pieces contributing to the bigger picture. The most significant piece is your payment history, accounting for 35% of your FICO score. Lenders want to see if you pay your bills on time. Next is your credit utilization ratio, representing 30% of your score. Keeping balances low shows good credit management. Other pieces include the length of your credit history, credit mix, and new credit. Section 3. Cracking the Credit Score Code Now that you know the puzzle pieces, let's see how they fit together to determine your score. Imagine each piece has a point value based on its importance. Your payment history, being the most crucial, carries the most points. Every on-time payment adds points, while late payments deduct points, impacting your overall score. Similarly, a lower credit utilization ratio earns you more points, while a higher ratio deducts points. The length of your credit history also plays a role. A longer history showing responsible credit management over time 
earns more points. Think of it like building a good reputation. A diverse credit mix, including credit cards, loans, and maybe a mortgage, demonstrates your ability to manage different types of credit responsibly, earning you more points. However, opening too many new credit accounts in a short period can lower your score, as it signals increased risk to lenders. Understanding how these points are awarded and deducted helps you make informed decisions to improve your credit score. Section 4. Your Credit Report Card Unveiled Your credit report is like your financial transcript. It's essential to understand what's in it. Three major credit bureaus collect and maintain your credit information. Each bureau generates a credit report. You can access your credit report for free annually. Review your reports regularly for errors. Think of it as a financial health checkup. Remember that payment history piece of the credit score puzzle? It's the biggest piece for a reason. Late payments can be major party poopers for your credit score. Think of it like this. Every time you miss a due date, it's like getting a bad grade on your financial report card. And just like in school, a few bad grades can bring down your overall average. On the flip side, consistently paying your bills on time is like acing every test. It shows lenders you're responsible and can handle your finances like a pro. Set up reminders, automate payments, or use a budgeting app, whatever works best for you. The goal is to make on-time payments a habit, not a chore. Remember, even one late payment can hurt your score, so make it a priority to pay all your bills on time, every time. Debt can feel like a monster lurking in the shadows of your finances. But fear not, we can tame this beast and boost your credit score in the process. Start by creating a budget and stick to it. Knowing where your money is going is the first step to taking control of your debt. Next, prioritize paying down high interest debt, like credit cards, first. These pesky debts can quickly drain your finances, so tackling them head on will save you money in the long run. Consider strategies like the debt snowball or avalanche method to make the process more manageable and motivating. The key is to find a debt repayment plan that works for you and your financial situation. Remember, tackling your debt not only improves your credit score, but also frees up more money for things you enjoy. It's a win-win situation. Credit utilization sounds complicated, but it's actually quite simple. Remember that 30% ratio we talked about earlier? That's your credit utilization sweet spot. It's like finding the perfect balance between using credit and showing you're not overly reliant on it. Think of your credit limit like a pie. You want to use only a small slice, ideally less than 30%, to keep lenders happy and your credit score healthy. One way to lower your credit utilization is to pay down your credit card balances. The lower the balances, the lower your utilization. Another strategy is to request a credit limit increase. However, be cautious with this option and avoid using the increase limit to overspend. Remember, keeping your credit utilization in check demonstrates responsible credit management and contributes to a healthy credit score. Section 4. Unlocking the secrets of your credit report. Your credit report is like a financial diary. And just like any diary, it's good practice to review it regularly. You're entitled to a free credit report from each of the three major credit bureaus, Equifax, Experian, and TransUnion, once a year. Requesting and reviewing your reports annually helps you stay informed about your credit history and identify any potential issues. Think of it as a free financial checkup. When reviewing your reports, look for any errors or inaccuracies, such as incorrect personal information, accounts you don't recognize, or inaccurate payment history. Disputing these errors is crucial, as they can negatively impact your credit score. You can dispute errors directly with the credit bureau, and they're obligated to investigate and correct any inaccuracies. Remember, staying informed and proactive about your credit report is essential for maintaining a healthy credit score and protecting your financial well-being. Section 1. Unlocking Financial Opportunities Imagine a world where doors swing open easily, granting access to the best financial products and services. 
That's the power of a good credit score. It's your golden ticket to a world of financial opportunities. With a healthy score, you become a sought after borrower, attracting favorable terms and conditions from lenders. Think of it as a VIP pass to the best financial deals in town. Need a loan to buy your dream car? A good credit score can get you a lower interest rate, saving you thousands of dollars over the life of the loan. Looking to rent an apartment? Landlords often favor applicants with good credit, making your search smoother and more successful. A good credit score unlocks possibilities, making your financial goals more attainable and less expensive to achieve. It's like having a secret weapon in your financial arsenal, empowering you to make smarter decisions and secure a brighter financial future. Lower interest rates, higher savings. Interest rates can feel like invisible money eaters, but with a good credit score, you can keep more money in your pocket. Think of interest as the price you pay for borrowing money. The higher your credit score, the lower the price. It's like getting a discount on your financial life. Lower interest rates mean lower monthly payments and less overall interest. Imagine saving hundreds, even thousands, just by having a good credit score. Section three, the rental game. A good score is your key. Finding the perfect apartment can be challenging, but a good credit score can give you a competitive edge in the rental market. Landlords often use credit checks to screen potential tenants, and a good score can make you a more desirable applicant. Think of it like this. A good credit score tells landlords you're responsible and likely to pay your rent on time. It provides them with a sense of security and confidence in your financial reliability. A good score can open doors to a wider range of rental options, including more desirable properties and neighborhoods. It can also give you more negotiating power when it comes to rental terms and conditions. In competitive rental markets, a good credit score can be the deciding factor between securing your dream apartment or settling for something less appealing. So if you're planning to rent, nurturing a good credit score is a wise investment in your future living arrangements. Section four, beyond loans and leases, the ripple effect. The benefits of a good credit score extend far beyond loans, credit cards, and rentals. Like ripples in a pond, a good score can positively impact various aspects of your life. Some employers, especially in finance-related fields, consider credit history as part of their hiring process. A good credit score can signal responsibility, trustworthiness, and sound financial judgment, making you a more attractive candidate. Insurance companies also use credit-based insurance scores to assess risk and determine premiums. A good credit score can lead to lower insurance rates, saving you money on car, renters, and even homeowners insurance. A good credit score is a testament to your financial health, and its positive effects can be felt in unexpected places. From securing better job opportunities to obtaining favorable insurance rates, a good score can open doors and create a smoother, more financially secure path for your future. Section one, safeguarding your score. Tips for long-term success. Congratulations, you've learned the ins and outs of credit scores. Now let's keep that score healthy. Think of it like maintaining a garden. Make on-time payments your mantra. It's the golden rule of credit management. Set reminders or automate payments. Keep an eye on your credit utilization. Remember the 30% rule. Avoid maxing out your credit cards. Review your credit report periodically. Be mindful of opening new credit accounts. Section two, credit myths debunked, separating fact from fiction. The world of credit scores can feel like navigating a maze of myths and misconceptions. Let's shed some light on common credit myths and separate fact from fiction. Myth number one, checking my credit score hurts my credit. False, checking your own credit score is considered a soft inquiry and does not impact your score. Myth number two, closing old credit cards improves my credit score. Not necessarily. Closing accounts can hurt your score by shortening your credit history and increasing your credit utilization ratio. Myth number three, I need to have debt to build credit. Absolutely not. Responsible credit management, such as paying your bills on time and using credit wisely, is key. Myth number four, credit repair companies can magically erase negative information from my credit report. Beware of such claims. Building good credit takes time and effort.
Section 3. Seeking help when you need it. Managing your credit and finances can sometimes feel overwhelming, but remember, you don't have to navigate it alone. If you're struggling with credit card debt, consider reaching out to a reputable credit counseling agency. They can provide guidance on debt management plans and negotiate with creditors on your behalf. Think of them as financial coaches, offering support and strategies to get you back on track. If you're facing financial hardship due to job loss, illness, or other unforeseen circumstances, don't hesitate to contact your creditors. Many creditors are willing to work with you during difficult times and may offer temporary relief options, such as forbearance or deferred payments. Remember, communication is key. Reaching out sooner rather than later can make a significant difference in managing your financial situation and protecting your credit score. Don't let pride or fear prevent you from seeking help when you need it. Section 4. Your Credit Journey. A marathon, not a sprint. Building and maintaining good credit is a continuous journey, not a one-time destination. Think of it as a marathon, not a sprint. There will be ups and downs along the way, but consistency and patience are your allies. Celebrate your progress, no matter how small. Every on-time payment, every reduction in your credit card balance is a step in the right direction. Remember, your credit score is a reflection of your financial habits over time. Just like training for a marathon, building good credit requires discipline and commitment, but the rewards are well worth the effort. A good credit score opens doors to financial opportunities, empowers you to achieve your goals, and provides peace of mind knowing you're in control of your financial future. So, lace up your financial running shoes and embrace the journey to a brighter, more secure financial future. As we've explored throughout this guide, your credit score is more than just a three-digit number. It's a powerful force that shapes your financial landscape. It has the potential to either empower or hinder your financial aspirations, influencing everything from securing affordable loans to landing your dream apartment. Think of it as your financial passport, opening doors to a world of opportunities or presenting roadblocks that can make achieving your goals more challenging and expensive. By understanding the factors that influence your credit score and adopting responsible financial habits, you take control of your financial narrative. You become the author of your credit story, writing a tale of financial responsibility, savvy decision-making, and a future brimming with possibilities. Remember, your credit score is not a reflection of your worth as an individual. It's a measure of your financial behavior. It's never too late to make positive changes and steer your credit in the right direction. The journey to building and maintaining good credit might seem daunting at first, but remember, even small steps can lead to significant rewards. Start by focusing on the fundamentals, paying your bills on time, keeping your credit card balances low, and reviewing your credit report regularly for errors. Think of it like tending to a garden. Consistent care and attention yield the most vibrant and fruitful results. Each on-time payment, every reduction in your credit card balance, and every error you dispute on your credit report is a step towards a healthier financial future. It's about making conscious choices that demonstrate your financial responsibility and commitment to building a strong credit profile. Don't get discouraged if you don't see immediate results. Building good credit takes time and consistency. Just like a seed that eventually blossoms into a beautiful flower, your credit score will flourish with patience, persistence, and a commitment to making sound financial decisions. You wouldn't wait until you're lost in the woods to start looking at a map, would you? The same principle applies to your credit. Don't wait until you're facing a financial hurdle to start paying attention to your credit score. Take charge today and make informed decisions that empower your financial well-being. Knowledge is power. And now that you're armed with a deeper understanding of credit scores, you're equipped to navigate the world of credit with confidence. Whether you're just starting your credit journey or looking to improve your existing credit profile, remember that you're in the driver's seat. Take the first step today. Request your free credit reports, review them carefully, and start implementing the strategies outlined in this guide. Embrace the journey, celebrate your progress, and watch as your credit score transforms from a source of anxiety into a badge of financial empowerment.
Imagine a life where you have the financial freedom to pursue your dreams without being held back by a low credit score. You can secure that dream home loan with a favorable interest rate purchase, a reliable car without breaking the bank, and even explore entrepreneurial ventures, knowing you have access to affordable credit. That's the power of good credit. It unlocks a world of possibilities and empowers you to live life on your terms. Building and maintaining good credit is an investment in your future, a gift you give to your future self. It provides peace of mind knowing you're prepared for whatever financial challenges or opportunities life throws your way. So take a deep breath, embrace the journey and start building the credit you deserve. Your financial freedom awaits and it all starts with understanding and harnessing the power of your credit score. Remember, you've got this.